Greetings, YouTubers. Greetings. Greetings and salutations. Today is hump day. So today is hump day. And I will do my product placement. Here's my product placement. Sardines. I bought these at Little. I like them because when I open the can, they are all laid out very orderly and obediently. There's no messing around. They're not all mushed in and jumbled together. They are lined up like nice little soldiers with their heads cut off. So that is my product placement. Sardines from Little. And this is my shout out. My shout out is screwdriver. Screwdriver. It is a Phillips head screwdriver that gets me in and out of all kinds of situations. And this is the screwdriver that lives in the kitchen drawer. And I have to dig through the danger drawer with all the loose knives and razor blades just to find them. On those rare occasions that I have to screw, 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 screw something in. And my reading material is I found this in a little library box, one of those free things. I've read this before on several occasions, but it is good to reread this from time to time. It is very philosophical. I'm in a tough spot right now in my personal life, and all your prayers and well wishes will help. But little stories like this does soothe the spirit. So that is my product placement. And just an update on Rocky. Rocky is growing like a weed. He got out the other night. I had to chase him back to get him in the house. It was getting ready to storm, but it got him back in. So when he's behaving himself, I will bring him and we'll do a video together. But today he is on a timeout because he was very naughty. And he got out and I had to put him in timeout which means he's in his crate for the rest of the day. So that's it. This is the product placement. Sardines. They are very healthy. Pretty much I am a vegetarian. Hi, everybody. I love all my YouTube friends. I really miss you when I don't see you. I love every one of you. But these are very healthy. Any sardine will do. It's a cold water fish, I think, and um, I'm pretty much a vegetarian, but I do have to eat things like sardines. I have to have a lot of calcium. That's so why I, I like the sardines. And this is my shout out. My shout out is my Phillips head screwdriver. He is a very helpful. I got him at the Dollar Tree. And he is a very welcome addition to my danger drawer. He lives in the danger drawer in the kitchen with all the loose knives. And this is suggested reading The Little Prince. The Little Prince. And today I'm just going to do a little short demonstration because, you know, even though I am a female, I do get a little bit of facial hair, um, and I it's been like this since in my teens, so it has nothing to do with my age. It's just every now and then, you know, I need to do a little bit of maintenance, and, you know, it's not unhealthy to have a little facial hair. I call it the Lagunae facial hair. It's for purpose, but, you know, I've... I would like to look as good as I can to attract the fellas and look for a, a mate and a spouse. So I need to do the maintenance. It's very important. So I'm going to do a little demo on my maintenance, on how I beautify and preserve what God gave me. 
it has to be done. It has to be done from time to time. It's just the way it goes. So what I like to do is take my Celo tape, my Scotch tape, and I do this now. It's, it, I'm not going to say it's painful. It does create sensation on my face. And it'll make me tear up, but I'm not going to cry. I don't cry anymore when I do this. But, I, you know, I've just got to do So here's what I do. I take, I take some Celo tape. And the, the stickier, the better. Duct tape's a way too sticky. I mean, we're talking way too sticky. Now, that'll make me cry. But I, I'll put this on the facial hair like that. Pass it down. Now, I just leave it. I just leave it. I've even slept in it like this. Um, I, I feel like if you leave it on for a little while, it, it's going to help. And so you all know what the next step is, is that I'm going to have to rip off this tape and just suffer with the, the, the pain. But i got to do what i got to do. And then um, it, it just beautifies, you know. I need to, to pull out as much beauty as I can while I have it. So I have to do that. But in the meantime, this is my product placement, sardines. I bought these ones at Little, but because of the pandemic and the supply chain issues, I've had to go from store to store. I had to buy a light bulb. I ended up going to six different stores to buy a light bulb. Come on, a light bulb. But whatever, they weren't there. I had to go from store to store to buy a light bulb, and it was only a light bulb. Why? Any, anywho. This is the product placement sardines. They're full of omega-3 fatty acids. I like to mash them up really good so that you don't even recognize them and then put a little mustard on them and then put it on toast. Or I'll mash them up beyond recognition and put them with my beans and rice. But I do have to eat them. It, I have to, even though I'm a vegetarian, I'm not able to do the vegan thing or, well, because I have a lot of dietary demands that are the result of medical issues. So I have to eat some things. But I, I don't eat, like, the red meat and all, like, nothing like that, nothing that's furry and cute. I'll never get to know the sardines that lived in the sea, but I, as far as, like, eating a cow, I just couldn't do it. And this is my shout-out. Phillips head screwdriver. I was trying to talk the straight head screwdriver to come on with me, but he was busy. I don't know what he was doing, but he was busy. And I do notice that Phillips head screwdrivers tend to be blue. And the flat head screwdriver tends to be red. That way you know which one is you're going to grab when it's all jumbled in the toolbox. That the blue one's going to be Phillips and the red one's going to be the flathead. That took me years to realize. Is, you know. Anyway, I'm smart, but I'm smart enough not to be in Mensa. All right? I'm smart enough not to join Mensa. But the blue one is Phillips and the red one is flathead. And my reading suggestion is the Little Prince. I like this story. I'm pro I found this in one of those little free libraries. I'm probably going to keep this. I tend not to keep anything. I don't like to have a lot of possessions. I like to live very minimal. I tend to move, and when you move a lot, you know it's better to have less, especially books. And the update on Rocky is he is growing like a weed, and he's in time out today because he was naughty he got out and he ran i had to chase him and it's and i got uh, he's hard to find in the dark but i got him i got him back in the house i did not spank him because i don't believe in corporal punishment but he is in a timeout so that is that and then this video today is just a quick demo on how to take care of facial hair 
that happens. It has nothing to do with age. It's just some people get it. Um, females get facial hair just like men do. But here's how I take care of it. I take the Celo tape, the, the scotch tape. Scotch tape is a little stickier than masking tape, but not as bad as duct tape. Duct tape is way too sticky, and it'll rip your skin off. So I just put some tape here, just like that, and I leave it to sit. And then I think it's getting time. You want to leave it on there for a little while so it just sticks really, really well. And then you, you're going to have to rip it off. You know what the next step is, so I'm going to do that, and then I'm going to probably cry a little bit, but it's tears of joy because I'm bringing out my natural beauty, my natural, natural beauty. So, here we go, ladies and gentlemen, and boys and girls, is this, this is it, this is it. One. Oh. <laughs> it's just this is the hardest part. It takes it's like ripping the bandaid off. It takes a little it takes a little bit. Okay. I have my handkerchief so because I'm gonna have to wipe it and it's gonna all right, sometimes blood. There's sometimes blood. I have to give you the warning that there's sometimes blood, but hopefully not because I let it get a little out of hand this month, but just been busy. I've been helping out a beloved person in my life that has been in need and I'm really having to rely heavily on my faith. God will get me through and then if you could pray for me, I would appreciate it. So here we go. I'm, I'm going to do it. <laughs> it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt. One. Okay, here we go. It's gonna hurt. <laughs> Two. Oh, I can't do it. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna pull it off. I'm gonna pull it. I'm gonna do it. It's gonna hurt. One. Two. Three. Oh. Look, I think I got it all. I even pulled out some of those wicked, wicked nose hairs. That, those icky, 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 icky nose hairs that come in. Okay. Go be okay for about another month. It seems like I have to do this once a month. That is my beauty secret, so shh, don't tell anyone that you saw me do that, especially the fellas. Nobody's going to want me if they see that I have to pull out the mustache every month. Okay, one more time on my product placement, and it is sardines. They're very good for you. I highly recommend that you eat as much omega-3 fatty acids. I also buy the cans of salmon. That's a little ew because you have to pull out the spinal column. I mean, I pull it out. I probably should eat it because I need the calcium, but I have a hard time eating a spinal column. Who wouldn't, right? It's like chewing on toenails, so I pull it out. This, I, you won't even know it. I mash it up beyond recognition. And enough mustard, you won't even know it. And then I have my shout out is my screwdriver. Remember that Phillips head, which this is a Phillips head. Phillips head screwdrivers are blue. Flat head screwdrivers are red. And my reading is the little print. I love my YouTubers, and I miss you when I don't see you. It's been very, very hectic this past couple of weeks, and I will need as much support 
emotional support that you can provide, I would appreciate it. And everything's going to be okay. That's what I keep telling myself. I miss all my friends. And I think about you when I'm not seeing you. I think about you as much as I can. I think about everybody. Hi, everybody. Oh, everybody is so kind. I just love all my YouTubers. And I think about you all the time when I'm not online. If I'm just out at the store, I always think, I wonder what my YouTube friends are doing right now because everybody's all over the world in all different places doing all different things and different cultures and different languages. It's just so fascinating to me to, sh to see your world and to see what you do in your daily lives and the, the music that you can play and the art that you can make. I just love to see it. I always look forward to seeing your creations, I, and I'm always happy to, to see what you've done, and always love your updates, and I hope you keep me posted, and I will keep you in my thoughts and prayers, and how much I love you, so give me a kiss, and a big hug, oh, and I love you, love you, love you, so I want you to have a good day, it's hump day. And it is going to be a great day. So all the best, my beautiful, beautiful friends.